Welcome to Centro, everyone. I'm Yadira Nova Salcedo. Bernie Williams is best known for his performance as an all-star center fielder for the New York Yankees, and most recently as a renowned musician. But many of his fans may not know the role he played in caring for his father, Bernabe, who was diagnosed with a rare and serious lung disease. This occurred at the peak of Bernie's major league career when he had to travel from New York to Puerto Rico to be by his father's side until he sadly passed away in 2001. With us this morning via satellite is Bernie Williams. Good morning, Bernie. Welcome to Centro. Good morning. Thank you so much for the opportunity to be here. Bernie, for those people who follow your career, they know who Bernie Williams is and the great work that you've done, the legendary player that you are, but it's so important for your fans out there to know that this new role means a lot to you. Talk to us about this new role that you're taking on right now. Well, yes, I am a part of uh, this great campaign called Breathless, uh, which, uh, you know, is designed to uh, just create awareness of uh, the fact that uh, it was uh, uh, a disease that my father suffered from and eventually took his life about 15 years uh, ago. It's called idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis, or IPF. And uh, this uh, campaign is designed to educate people uh, regarding uh, that uh, subject that uh, definitely touched me in a very personal and uh, in a tragic way, uh, you know, about 15 years ago. So I'm uh, sort of rendering uh, a tribute to my dad's memory uh, and uh, 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 basically just trying to create awareness about this condition uh, uh, that uh, it, it touches. Uh, it's more, actually, it's more common than uh, people may think. It's rare, but at the same time, it's so common. So take us back, Bernie. I understand that when it, this started, your father started to experience the different symptoms when you were at the height of your career. Talk to us about that. Yeah, uh, you know, like I said before, my, my dad, uh, uh, you know, he was a very active person. Uh, he was the one that sort of trained me, uh, started, you know, uh, talking to me and taking me to the baseball field with my brother when I was about eight years old. Uh, yeah, he took me to, you know, to the beach to, you know, to do uh, things out in, the, you know, the open air. You know, he was a, a big thing for him, and we started uh, noticing uh, that he started uh, getting these symptoms, like he, you know, this persistent dry cough, uh, his ability to breathe and uh, the things that he would uh, take for granted, like, you know, like walking yes. up a flight of stairs or, uh, you know, trying to do some physical activity, it became a lot harder for him. Yeah. Uh, and it was this progressive uh, wow. limiting uh, ability to breathe, uh, which uh, sort of took us, uh, I mean, made us uh, make the determination to take him to the doctor. Uh, which eventually uh, he had uh, uh, the opportunity to be diagnosed with uh, uh, idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis. Uh, in, and then after that, it was probably about four or five years after that, he passed away. Yes, and exactly. And now recently for Father's Day, Bernie, this is a time that's very special. And this is your way of honoring your father's life, correct? Absolutely. Uh, he, my father made a lot of sacrifices, you know, to make sure that uh, my brother and I were raised, you know, the right way. Uh, he spent the time and uh, he really cared about us and, and his legacy as a father. Uh, uh, he was, you know, the inspiration, and I, I still say it to this day that he was my hero, uh, you know, as far as, you know, being the person that I am today, I took a lot from what he taught me and uh, the way that he lived his life. So it is, it is very important to me to have this opportunity to uh, pay tribute to his life and to his memory through this campaign, uh, Breathless, uh, and uh, at the same time, just uh, create awareness about, you know, the condition that took his life uh, uh, a long time ago. Yes, and how can viewers get more information, Bernie? Uh, yes, there's a, a website uh, called breathless.com and, uh, you know, it's basically designed to educate people about this condition and uh, I, I, obviously it's a great source, you know, for people to know about this disease. We also want to congratulate you, Bernie, on your successful music career. 
Yes, thank you so much. Thank you. I had an opportunity to go back to school and got my degree in jazz performance out of the Manhattan School of Music. And now I'm, uh, I don't know, I'm just the regular rock star <laughs> after playing That's great. baseball. <laughs> You're very talented in whatever it is that you do. Thank you so much for being with us on Centro Bernie and for bringing awareness about this. So thank you so much. Thank you for the opportunity. Very glad. To get a direct link to the Sin Aliento Breathless website, where you can get more information about this rare lung disease, you can visit us online at cbsboston.com slash centro. And like every week, we want to remind you that you can get more information on today's show and our past shows. You can watch both the English and the Spanish versions of Centro right now if you go to our website. If you don't have time right now, come back later for more of Centro. We also want to invite you to connect with us online. Like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter and Instagram. I'm Yadira Nova Salcedo, inviting you to step forward to a better you. See you next time.